you guys doing? Good morning. It's a cold morning here in Syracuse. I'm going down to Easton, Pennsylvania. And I just already picked up, I picked up a load last night. I tried delivered two of them. And uh, I overnighted in the, the shipper up here in Syracuse. There's really not many truck stops and I'm running out of time anyway. <coughs> so I overnighted, I just got my drive clock back. It's about seven o'clock in the morning. We're going out to Easton, it's about almost a four hour drive. Woo, it's so, so icy though, you'll see. It's an icy morning, as you can see. Shipper is getting plowed. They had a little bit of this, uh, snow squall last night, but we are out of here. 0.3 miles ahead. Turn left on New Venture Gear Drive. I had Route to shift my tandems last uh, this morning because uh, the load the, the load is is like 1,700 pounds. It's not even like heavy. No, it's like 1,500 pounds. It's not heavy at all. And this is so snowy. I couldn't I couldn't slide them. I couldn't slide them at all. Look at this. But go burn some gas, head on the road, and uh, gotta pick up something to eat and use the bathroom because there really is no place to do, do that here. I had to pee in a freaking water bottle last night, but it's alright. Alright, guys, and we're off. I had to stop by Circle K and Tully. I had to go and get. Coffee. That's one of the things, man. Can't, you can't live without it. Coffee. And I just had to go get it. So, got me also a breakfast burrito. I got egg whites and uh, two strips of bacon. But I was uh, expecting not to. Turn left on need US to get 11 more groceries South. Because I'm going and turn right. So I was like, let me just pick something up. I only got like. Only like seven bucks so just picked it up eating some food see i found it here it is right here tight all right move that so this is the right place gotta sit and wait there's like five trucks ahead of me or whatever i literally just broke the yard in it was like blah, blah, blah. i'm in sweats i gotta change I was just too lazy this morning to do it. They tried to give me another free trip. And I was like, nah, not. Let's hope we come down to the yard and wait. This place is super tight. There it is, there it is, there it is. Ooh. Got all this crap on my truck. So I just pull in here and wait. Look at this. Ah. They told me it was canceled, then they said it wasn't canceled. Now they're saying that I was supposed to go to, uh, get a load on the 27th. I thought I was going home. Now they're sending me to Ohio. I don't know. So they tell me I have two more loads. The load that they're showing is not the actual load that I have. And all this other jazz. All I know is that I had to call, show them that it was canceled, and all this stuff. I'm not happy about it. This road it. is restricted. Always obey crazy. locally posted regulations. This road's not restricted. So I'm pretty upset about it. Literally, that's like what happened. They were just like, yeah. Turn right. Then turn left. 
we want you to uh, go down and go Point get this. Turn right on Van Buren Road. And I was like, yeah, no problem. That's fine. But turn right on Van Buren Road. It makes no sense to me because. So they tell me that I have to go over there and pick up this load, but the thing is, they still haven't dispatched it on me. And it's Turn right on Main Street. annoying as shit because they're usually pretty spot on with the dispatching. But they put them backwards, so I had to... It says that I'm picking up the load on the 27th, and then picking up the load uh, for today in Tarkanic. But I'm like sitting there, I'm like, how am I supposed to pick up this load when it's backwards? She was like, oh, dispatch the right way. No, it's not. I don't think it is. I think it's fucked up and it's, they, they don't want to admit it. So I'm just going straight to go pick up this load in Tocanic and, uh, and take it out to Wood, 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 Woodlawn, uh, Ohio to say fuck it. Because honestly, like, it's bullshit. Here we are, we're at Propaganda, we got to drop an oak to go pick up, and then we're flying out to Ohio. I got four hours and 46 minutes left. They do got a scale here, so I don't have to worry about it. Hopefully this load isn't that heavy. Usually proper gamble loads are 36K, maybe sometimes 18K, sometimes 45K. Let's go see. So they said drop back K and pick up an H. I got a um, really nice package last night. This is a good way to end the night. Got a little care package from the local chaplain down here at the TA. And it has a little bit more stuff inside here, but really nice. It made my night. I had a cruddy day today, and it's in the Buckhorn TA. That's a good man.